Hello, 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 friends. Welcome to Netta's Nest. This is Netta. And as you see, the orange box has arrived. I have fallen captive of the Timu wave. I was like, no, I'm not going to do it. I kept contemplating. No, I'm not going to do it. I said, it cannot possibly be that cheap. But I tell you, I got on the website and went absolutely ham and spent, I'm going to say, um, a lot of my Mother's Day um, money funds that I had stashed away for myself. So I said, okay, I, I'm into doing a haul. So let me do a little haul for everybody. This is a TV haul. I fell on the bandwagon. I hope I haven't um, bumped my head on a bunch of crap that I purchased, but I thought I would share it with you guys. I just want to say thank you friends for coming back by and checking me out. My name's Netta. I'm the wife of a deputy, the mother of three teenagers, and I am a nurse. That's, um, on hiatus at the moment but right now welcome to my Timu haul let's see what we have I've opened it almost I've got to split this part here so hold tight all right guys the box is open and that was a tough box to open all righty so there are these sponges I'm really big into these sponges and dishwashing I've I buy so many of them already and throw them in the garbage can. So I think these are on there for like a, a dollar a piece or something like that. So I got three packs of them. I thought these would have been so cute for my dog, baby. <laughs> so I don't think they were probably six dollars, probably. So let me see what they look like. Oh, those are too cute. Look at those. This mom will go trip if you see those. Aren't they adorable? <laughs> and that's for Gigi's baby, which is me. Um, what is this? I think this is a dress that I saw. And I'll probably put up on the, all the materials garbage. Oof, and it smells horrid. Chickney. I saw this on the Chickney site and then I went on this site and I saw it for cheaper and then I'll do like a little try on for you guys and I'll put it side by side when I got that for me. It's a 4X because I was afraid it was coming from China. It was going to be those little bitty sizes but I think it's pretty huge. Oh, it smells terrible. It's like chemicals. Those back in there for the baby. Let's see what this is. I think this is something else I got for the baby also. Now I got this for my boys. Because everybody in the house name begins with a K. So I picked up these shirts with K's on them. Looks like it's not half the party. Then they have these eyelashes. I thought these were cute. They're pretty fancy. And I'm like, okay, I like falsies. I'll go for it. They were a buck. Oh, well, what was this? I don't know what this, I don't remember what this was. There's this little sweater that I saw that I might have got an oversized so I can just wear it off the shoulder. Oh, that's pretty. This is good material. This one, this one's pretty good. Oh, let's see what this is. Oh. I like a one and done. And I've been hearing a lot of people talk about blue. So I thought I would pick something up that was blue. And this is a jumper. And I I keep a jumper on. If I don't keep a jumper on, I have an oversized um, pants. So that's pretty cute. I like that pattern. Yeah. You'll see. I'll try it on for you guys. You'll see it on the side. Let's see what this is. Uh oh, I got that for the baby. But I don't think I put mom. I don't think I, I thought I got something else for him. But that's pretty cute. Something he can wear through the summer. 
Alrighty, I need to wash all this stuff. Oh, I love little kids and loafers. These little shoes are like five or eight dollars, one of them. How adored is that? Those are adorable. <laughs> Aren't those cute? Look at those loafers. They're, um, they're, they're too big for them. I love this color green. I don't remember what this was. Yellow. Mm. Let's see. I don't think I can return any of this stuff. I think um, it is what it is. Oh, oh the material is garbage. But it's going to be nice for the summertime. Oh, this is a beautiful outfit for brunch. This material is a little bit better than that. This is another one and done. I love wide leg pants. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's pretty. I don't know how many that is, guys. <laughs> Isn't that adorable? <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> okay. Well, back to my house. Why are there two pair of these little shoes in there? That's ridiculous. I didn't order. That doesn't make any sense. This is this camouflage skirt that I wanted. I thought this was like sexy as all get out. But I'm going to have to really do this in. I'm going to wear this with a red shirt and some red heels. Ugh, that's cute. Oh, I'm the Gigi. Look what I got. I love my Gigi. <laughs> yeah, guys. I, I, yeah, I went ham. I did. I must admit. I saw these little sandals. And I had just bought some white sandals. But I used to wear strap-up heels all the time. And these are some strap-up sandals. Flats. I thought those would be cute to go with um, two of those outfits. Probably all of them. Ah, oh, the smell. Oof. I can see from right here, this is going to be. Y'all, if y'all see my pictures, y'all know my boost is wide. There's no, there's no give in these. But I love those, that pattern. But look how cheap that is. Look how cheap that is. I guess you get to money's worth, you know. My mama used to work for this place years ago. I think it was called Pixie Playmate, if anybody know about that place. They used to make really cheap little clothes, and I remember them. Look at that. There's a little rust spot at the bottom. Okay, let's see the top. Top must... Ugh. Ugh. I got some cute heels. I'll jazz it up. All right, two more guys. I think. Oh, this is heavy. What is this? Oh, some more. Oh, oh, Capri Bit Riches. That's right up my alley, right there. Oh yeah. I gave more at the church. Oh, to her anyway. And one more after this. Then I'm going to put you guys in a hole that I'm going to, um, going to have to do some hell of a editing. Now, this dress, this is what drove me to Tina. I kept seeing this outfit on Chick Me. Is it Chick Me? Yeah. But not all Chick Me. Sometimes you go on this site, they have, um, they're all inclusive, and then you can't find anything um, higher than a 1X. And I, of course, I need a 3X or so. But this dress is what had me about to lose my mind. 
And even though I'm I'm pear shaped and I'm you know, we all know what pear shape is. I'm pear shaped, but I'm smaller pear and this is gonna be ugh, that's gonna be entirely too big. We'll see. It's cute though. I love the graffiti on there, whatever it is. And here's another little cutie. <laughs> Look at that. That's cute. All right, guys. So you guys hold tight. I'm going to try it on and take a couple shots for you guys. And somehow I'll be able to edit, edit it and get it in there. I don't know how, but I will do my best. Hold tight. Hey, guys. Here's the one outfit. This is what really drew me to the teenage song. It's always outfit on. Tiffany and I really wanted it. I thought it'd be complimentary. I got a bigger size, but I think if I you make one cross move, the whole thing will go down. But I really wanted it to hang on the side. I wanted it to be nice and airy. I like the big bellow sleeves. It's nice and airy. I enjoy it. It's pretty. It's really big up here. It's a 4X. I should have gotten a 3X or a 2X, but this is it. It comes right below my knee. I think it's pretty cute. Got me modeling clothes. So two, this is a two-piece outfit. This is right up my alley. I love a nice comfy pants. Some give there. Comes about halfway here. This shirt here, I'm not a fan. This is mostly a jacket. It has one little button here. Uh, I know a lot of girls wear the clothes that's tucked in halfway like that. I'm not a fan of that. I mean, you know, if it's nice and good in the summertime, more than likely I'm going to do one of these numbers. If I'm going somewhere, I'm going to pull it up some. And that's got to be a little bit more casual for me. There's no pockets, so that bothers me. Or, I don't know, probably can get a belt and belt it. It can be business attire. Either or. It's very comfortable. I really do like this. I like the big sleeves. I like the collar. I can pop it. I like that it comes down. A nice little V-cut here. But this right here, I don't know if I would have to tuck this in. Sorry for showing my girls. Yeah, I'll probably. I think I would build it. That's what I probably would do. But all in all, I think this is 10 out of 10. I like it. It's comfortable. I have lots of ideas for this. When I pulled this one out of the bag, I knew it was, this was a no. It has no give. Look at the pants. The seat's like right here. That fold up. Yeah, the belt belt hanging out. If it was. I'm pear shaped. I'm over. I'm about 200. I'm plus 200. I'm about 230 pounds. And um, I wear typically 2x, 3x, 18, 20, 22. Um, 22 is my new. <laughs> New size, but these pants, as I know, there's no give. They don't come up. When I keep saying I'm pear shaped because I'm small up here, and then I curve out down below. But this is enough. No. Give this to my sister. This would have been an absolute love. I love this color. I love the halter top. The honey, I tell you, trying to pull this part up over from here to here. Mm -mm. I like to bust through the whole thing. It's tight, and as you see here, all the pleats are given. Here, it's, there's no give, nothing. I can't really zip it up in the back, but it's really, really pretty. And if I was, um, come fuck with anyhow. This is enough. It's beautiful though. I love the yellow. I love the bell leg. I love the bell leg. I love the halter. It has this little tie in the back right here. But I can't get, I'm sure I probably can zip it up. But I um, might need to call the fire department to get me out of it. But this one is this. And this would have been a definite. If, <laughs> only if. But this is enough. But it's a love though. But it's enough. Too small. This would have been a win. You're in the frame, honey. You're in the frame. I don't like how it's kind of, kind of searchy right here. Like I told you, I get kind of small right up in here, but I do like that it's a lot of room here in the side. I would definitely keep this one because I can wear this one around the house. And well, I would everywhere actually, but the fit's just not that immaculate. I don't like how sometimes some things right here get all big because, as my husband say, I have a short torso. There's only this much room that's here. But um, overall, it's given. It's summertime. I can't complain. Put on some nice little sandals with it and um, brunch. I would do it. And, and this is something else I don't like either being um, plus size. Yeah, hear that? That's a no no. When my clothes make all that noise, you will not hear me coming shushing. You'll smell me coming because I smell good, but you won't hear me coming shushing. So I won't be wearing this too far because I don't like that noise. And I don't like how this line right here really takes away from my curves. I, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty curvy, but I don't like how this right here, this is here. I don't like these, I wish these pockets wasn't here. And maybe this, all this stuff will fade in the background. See, that's not much here at all. There's tricks. Let make a dragon dog again. Alrighty, guys. It's okay. You know, beach, vacation, I'm wearing on a cruise ship. It's okay. Somewhere noisy one, and no one can hear the shushing sound. Well, this is the mock denim, the denim that's been the rave. Everybody's doing the denim thing. Denim is on 31. And this is like clown denim. So their sizes are questionable. You know, they're just questionable. So this really is going to need a nice big thick belt to um, to just look presentable. I mean, it's doable. It's comfy on the thighs. I'm going to say very comfy. But as far as my waist here, and because of the um, how, dip, how, how, how I am portioned, it's just not working. It's not working. If I can find a nice, probably one of those jean thick belts on some type of belt to put on that would be good maybe that'll help um bring this in i also was wondering if i can um i don't know what i would be able to do i don't know i'm gonna figure out what i can do with this because i like how comfortable it is on my thighs but it's too sandy down here 
And I'm that girl that I don't like my guys, you know, communicating with each other. I don't like them touching and rubbing like my clothes pulled up. But I really get a kick out of how cozy they are. Now, these were just pants. That was one thing. Who knows? Maybe I just cut the top off and put some elastic in the waist and just wear them as some palazzo pants. Like I did with all the rest of my pants. But otherwise, yeah. It's not giving like I thought it was going to be. But it's comfortable, though. So I have one more for you guys. I think a skirt and a shirt. And we'll go from there. I was really drawn to this um, camel skirt. I wanted to wear it with these red little shoes I have in a red top. And this slip right here. And all the way up. You can show as much leg as you want to. It also has pockets. It's pretty, it's pretty airy and pretty cute. My husband, like, you don't know how he feels about the, the zipper right here. But it comes up. But I, um, I don't know. I'm not really into camouflage, but I thought this was really cute. I'm not really sure. Uh, huh, I'll come up with something. And this is one of those, those, um, what is that, Shape Alex or Shape that body wear and that the rave that's on um, Instagram and on um, TikTok. I, I love the whole body thing. It's shorts, underwear, you know, pants, but this right here, no bra, no nothing. Holy girls still, I don't have big girls, but they, you know, they stay like a pack of wild dogs, you know, holding down. And tucks in everything. And if this was green, or I could even just, you know, hey, summer day, just going to the store, then this would be sufficient. So, you know, if you hide me, you probably be showing. I tend to do that at times. And it kind of gives you, I don't know what's going on back here. But hey, this is just a skirt. It's okay. Now, this orange top I fell in love with. I got it in the oversized. I really didn't want to wear it off the shoulder. Never mind the skirt. Didn't want to take it off and find something to go with this. This can go with anything in your closet. This shirt, jeans, and even just from behind. It goes from, this is a solid color. It goes with the camouflage. But I thought this was really cute and adorable. I love orange, rust, um, all those fall colors. Anything with peaches and oranges and rusties and browns. I love those colors on my skin. Coral. But this is cute. And it's about 80 degrees. It's still like 90 here in Florida. But soon as the next year come around or just being out and about in air condition, uh, date night out with hubby, this will be great with a cute pair of jeans. Every single I love this. This is a wear. The material is excellent. All right, guys, here's a little closeout from the Timu um, shopping haul. It came to like a total of $188 and some change. Um, that yellow outfit was must have been a freebie. It was like a dollar and some change, and it was a size 14. No wonder why I needed a slingshot to get into it. Um, the most expensive thing was the black and white outfit, which is about $18. And, of course, and I couldn't wear it. But everything was fairly cheap. So I even put the lashes on to see how they would work out. They were um, looked pretty natural, not that bad. And um, so everything was basically $188 and some change. Um, I was saying, would I shop from Team U again? Huh, I don't know. It all depends. Uh, maybe, maybe not. Uh, there's a possibility that I might um, shop from them again. Um, I don't know. It was just nice to do a little bit of shopping because I really hadn't, have not been doing, well, I have not been doing a lot of shopping, but recently I've been shopping more for clothes. I did do another Ross haul, but guess I took everything back because I was like, okay, now that you haven't even received your your Timu haul, yeah, so put that. Anyhow, I digress. So anyhow, um, the Timu haul, I would say, huh, I'm going to give that an 8 out of 10. I was quite impressed with several of the items. I can't complain. They were really nice. Even the lashes were really cute. The, um, uh, it was good. $188 for several things. I'm going to put a tally right um on the other side <laughs> over here somewhere. I'll put the tally right there just to let you know. Um, um, how the things were itemized and what they cost. So thank you for coming to Netta's Nest. Thank you for inviting me into your home. Thank you for coming into my home.